Finally, I got this thing to download. You would think we would have good internet in heaven. Now let me see how this works. Hmm. I click here to see myself. Oh god, I look awful. This camera is not very flattering. Oh good, some folks are logging on now. Hello, hello? Is anyone there? You don't have to knock on your screen, I can see you. Good, good. But this camera is not very flattering, I'd have to say. Please mute yourself as I let more people on. How rude to tell me to shut up. No, click on the microphone in the bottom left and mute yourself so we don't have to hear any background noise. Uh... Okay. Welcome to the meeting. Welcome to the meeting. Welcome to the meeting. My camera's working. I can't see myself. Do you see the start video button down in the left corner? Click on that. Oh, okay. God, I look awful. There must be something wrong with my camera. There's nothing <coughs> wrong with your camera. <coughs> Peter, could you mute yourself, please? Do you guys like my cat? It's rather unprofessional, I think. If you ask me, I look pretty good on this camera, if I say so myself. Enough, guys. Peter, could you mute yourself, please? I now call our meeting to the order of the Committee for Healing and Reconciliation through the Incarnation of the Son of God Task Force. Gemma, could you read the minutes from the last meeting? The Committee for Healing and Reconciliation through the Incarnation of the Spirit of God Task Force opened their meeting last month with their prayer to the Almighty and met for three hours. We decided we would meet monthly on the second Tuesday unless otherwise notified by the chair and co-chair if two-thirds of the task force agreed to meet another day. We approved that a quorum would be one half of angels present unless three-quarters of the whole committee voted to, meet, to set aside the quorum for a particular vote. We closed the meeting with a prayer to God Almighty. Is that all we did? Peter, were you wanting to say something? Peter, you need to unmute yourself to talk. I will remind the rest of you to mute as well. Yes, <clears throat> I was wondering if we could amend the bylaws to the task force to allow 10 minute breaks every hour, unless three fifths of those present vote to set aside the break time. I recommend we refer that motion to the bylaws subcommittee of the task force until the next meeting. Really, it should be the food and snack subcommittee that makes the decision. I'll be right back, my cat wants to be fed. Should the subcommittee for the theology weigh in on something so important? Okay, okay, enough. We will take that up at the next meeting. Now let's get down to business. God Almighty has tasked us with working out the details with the incarnation of God on earth. Yes, Peter, you need to unmute yourself, please. Yes, I don't really get it. How this whole thing is going to work? It does seem an odd way of going about saving creation. Man, I look it on this camera, though. I mean, it would just be easier if God just took over and so sorted it all out directly. And this camera is adding 10 pounds. Isn't it a little weird that God would become a human? Let the minutes reflect disagreement on the task force about God's plans. And how do you spell incarnation? You are you did. Oh, sorry. Uh, now I forgot what I was going to say. Ainsley. Can you get that cat out of the picture? So unprofessional. And what's a cat doing in heaven? I thought only dogs go to heaven. Enough already. Running this meeting is like herding cats. According to the memo from God Almighty, we are supposed to contact a Mary and a Joseph to get their buy-in. I don't get that. Like I said, couldn't God Almighty just make them do it? Do I look heavy on this screen? Something about free will, I think. Shouldn't the subcommittee on the theology have something to say about that? I'll talk to them. They won't be frightened by me. I have a rather friendly, attractive demeanor, don't we? Make me the host, though. Okay, everyone, mute yourself and turn your video off. We don't want to overwhelm them. I'll invite them to join our Zoom call now. Hello? Hello? Am I on now? Greetings, you who are highly favored. The Lord is with you. What's that? Could you turn up your volume? I said, do not be afraid. You have found favor with God. You will conceive and give birth to a son, and you are going to call him Jesus. Mary, who is Zooming us at this time of night? 
I was just sleeping, and what's this about conceiving? Don't be a grumpy old man. It's just an angel saying I'll have a son and his name will be Jesus. That's right, Joseph. Do not be afraid to take Mary home as your wife. Sounds rather shady to me. And this is not a good time for this to be happening. We have to go to Bethlehem because this crazy fool of an emperor wants to do his census. We don't have any place to stay when we get there. I am the Lord's servant. May your words to me be fulfilled. Okay, okay, let this be done. Good, good. The Community for Healing and Reconciliation through the Incarnation of the Spirit Task Force will make all the arrangements. The what? Well, that one as good as can be expected. Let the Ministry Flagged Agreement by Mary and Joseph. You are You're muted! muted. Rats! I forgot what I was going to say. Someone will need to make some housing arrangements in Bethlehem. I heard about a place there. Make me a house and I will zoom them in. Shouldn't we vote? Do they accept pets? Everyone, mute yourself. Peter, it's the button at the bottom left. Who is this? I'm, I'm busy. Yes, I would like to book a room for two, if you will. One of your best rooms with a cradle. Ha! Are you kidding me? With that fool emperor calling for a census, there's not a room in the inn. Well, there has to be something. The Committee for the Healing and Reconciliation through the Incarnation of the Spirit Task Force had made plans. The what? No, never mind. We have a manger out back I can let you use for a discount. I even let you have pets. No cats, though. That will have to do, I suppose. Rather unprofessional, though. Huh. Tell them to keep the noise down when they get here. No singing. Lights out at ten. Well, that was a disaster. The Son of God born in a manger? Who would have thought that? Let the minutes reflect our change of plans to have God incarnated in a stall in a rundown town in the boondocks. It's not optimal, I would agree. What's next on the agenda? This Zoom meeting seems like an eternity. Well, according to our agenda, we are supposed to contact some shepherds. Make me the host. I'll do it. Me. Hello, hello. Click on the camera down at the bottom. Ba ba. Internet is always bad out here in the fields on our phones. This is what we got. Do not be afraid. I bring you good news that will cause great joy for all the people. What's that? What did you say? Turn up the volume down there. Ba ba. It is a little hard to understand you with all the sheep making that much background noise. What do you expect? We are shepherds. Who are you? Ba. I am an angel sent to tell you that a savior will be born in the town of Bethlehem. Aren't you a little heavy to be an angel? This, the camera adds 15 pounds. Ba, ba. Quiet, what do you want us to do? Ba. Go and see what is happening. Easier said than done. These sheep are hard to get anywhere. Ba. This is a complete disaster. I don't ah. know, the sheep are kind of ah. cute. Unmute yourself. yourself! Oh, sorry. Uh, now I forgot what I was going to say. We have one more thing on our agenda. We are supposed to contact three wise men from the East. I sh Shall I do the honors? Make me the host, and I will invite them in. Hello. 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 Wait a moment. I was expecting three wise men. What? You don't think women can be wise? Ah, uh, sexism rears its ugly head. Women have always been wiser than men. No, no, no. It's just my agenda says three wise men. My guess is that a man wrote that agenda. That's for sure. Amen to that. Well, no matter. You are now instructed to follow a star to find the savior of the world. Wouldn't Google Maps work better? And bring gifts to the savior. What kinds of gifts? I don't know. Gold, incense, and perfume, maybe. It's because we are women you think we should bring perfume, right? Of all the nerves. Whatever you think will work. Just show up when you're supposed to. You think we'll be late because we're women, right? That's ridiculous. 
No, no, no. You got me all wrong. Well, this was a complete disaster. What do you expect? A committee planning the incarnation of God? It is an odd plan. God Almighty sent us Mary, Joseph, shepherds, three wise men, excuse me, wise women, and not a single cat? Not very professional, if you ask me, but it will be beautiful. It will be, and I know something about beauty, if you ask me. Let the minutes reflect we adorn with agreement that God Almighty loves God's children so much, God will be with them. Now, how do you spell incarnation again? Peter, for God's sakes, unmute yourself. Push the unmute button. button. Oh, darn, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, yeah. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas.